is to show you how to assemble tundra. So we have the tundra parts lying on the floor here in the garage or wherever you, you have it. Um, the first thing to do is to assemble the rear wheels. So if we go to the rear wheels, make sure that the location shaft is clear of any grit. We lift the frame, ensure that the locating screw heads are open. And you will see on the shaft that there is a mark. That mark is predetermined height, so you slide the shaft down to just above that tape mark. Down to this position, hold it into that position, and finger tighten each of these nuts. The key is not to over tighten them, so finger tight. Then you take an Allen key and you are tightening them up to their firm position and then simply another quarter. Make sure that the rear brake is in the off position. Turn the large part of the wheel to the back and you can lock the wheel down so it's in its park position. We go to the other side, you can see this is finished in its locked position. So the frame is now ready to assemble. The easiest way of doing it is to line the frame up, step inside, lift the frame and slide the two halves together. You'll see that there is tape on here. The tape is because this has already been preset to a particular type of wheelchair. If you don't, you can move this frame in and out to accommodate the width of the wheelchair you wish to use. And for our purposes, we'll slide it into this position. The next is to put the two front wheels on. The wheels have got self-locking. There's a nipple and a shaft and a hole where the wheel will slide. I'll show you what that is. And if the frame, you can see that the wheel will slide in and there is a channel and the nipple will slide into the channel to the other side and lock down. Quick, quick release. So if we locate the wheel, the nipple you'd put at six o'clock. You hold the wheel on the outside, lift the frame, simply put the shaft into the channel, push the nipple up, slide the wheel in and it's locked. Repeat the exercise on the other side, lift the wheel, place the nipple at six o'clock. The frame is lifted slightly, place the nipple into the channel, push the nipple up, locate it and it's locked. So if we step back we can see the frame 